Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to the final episode of Oni Mice. Let's go ahead and get started in three, two, one. Take two. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> Oh, that hurt. <laughs> It is. Oh. I mean, yeah, once you check in, you get to relax. That's what we want, right? Oh my god, girl. <laughs> Yeah, I think, you know, if it ever snowed here again in Florida, oh my god, Floridians would go batshit crazy. The ones who know the snow, like me, we'd be fine. Be like, okay, this is just normal for now. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Choking. I'm trying to die. Yeah, I think something stuck in my throat. I would give my water, but I'm not good enough. I don't feel like it. <laughs> Get it after. Yeah, I wonder how that's going to go. That's a good title for a final episode. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I mean, well, yeah. <laughs> it's always white. <laughs> Very nice. Now, <laughs> oh. I mean, she got changed. <laughs> Is 
because she's just giving me feels to that one um, Kobayashi OVA episode that was just so good. But that was that was the end episode. Also, them going for Valentine's Day, which is super adorable as fuck, and almost cried. Uh-oh. <laughs> but see the biggest thing, like, eventually, he's going to have to turn back into a boy, right? So when is that going to happen? <laughs> yeah. Oh, really? Did you really just ask that? Yeah, I mean, honestly, we really don't want you to get a nosebleed in front of them, so... <laughs> You know, because, I mean, you three, well, no, you four at the time where you really don't have to worry about your weight and everything, you know, their age plus older, yes, that's when sometimes we're really worrying about our weight and how we look and stuff, and it super sucks. <laughs> oh my god <laughs> <laughs> oh my god
That is the wrong time and place to get an erection. Oh. Hmm? We gonna figure this out. Yeah, do you really want to continuously stay stuck as a girl for a little while longer? Are you okay with that? So no. Got to think about that. Come on.
Oh, that's pretty. Go to sleep. <laughs> I gotta make sure. <laughs> yeah, you in the clear. <laughs> oh, if you only knew. <laughs> had fun though, right? Yeah.
You know exactly what we mean. Okay. It just shows you how much he's grown. Cutest thing ever. Right. Final thoughts on this. I mean, this this was good. It was funny because, like, what the first or second week of this show, um, I got a comment of someone saying, "Yeah, this is just a female version of ReZero." I mean, not ReZero. Um, real life. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And honestly, I, I even thought that when I watched the first episode where I was like, yeah, I was like, I'm kind of getting real life vibes on this. Um, and such, except instead of him, you know, still being a guy and doing guy stuff, he, you know, you, you change sexes and stuff. And honestly, that's a really interesting idea. I've never seen like shows or just anything in general do something like that. So it's just really nice and brand new and fresh in my opinion. Um... It felt very underrated to me. And I'm not saying that in like a bad way. I'm saying that in a good way. Because it had a lot of shows to complete with. Uh, I mean complete. <laughs> compete with this season. And I mean there there was a lot of shows. So many different shows that I was watching. And or. Well we can't talk about that yet. Because it's not the day of that day. Um, and it really held its own. I mean, like, I didn't see a lot of people essentially talking about this show um, as much. But if I did, it was a very small group and such. And I mean, I'm glad that it ends on a happy note. I mean, but at the same time, like, number one, I am glad that he decided to just, you know, continuously stay as a girl. That does open it up, I'm guessing, manga-wise. Like, I don't know what chapter they are on for this series that we could continue on up until the day is you know we get to the next point where it's like okay um you're slowly but surely changing into a boy again what do you want to do you want to stay a girl longer or do you just want to go ahead and continue your old life as a guy again and such i do love the fact that we got to see that in today's episode because honestly my biggest thing was what if we get to the end of this and we don't even get like a moment where it's like oh hey he's slowly but surely changing back into a boy and He's got to choose between staying a girl maybe a little while longer or just continuing his life back to normal as a guy for the rest of his days and only really have memories of having relationships with these characters and such. And so I am glad that he decided to stay. I mean, yes, it was either him drinking it or all the girls freaking out in the morning and be like, hey, yo, what the fuck? <laughs> because, oof. <laughs> But, I mean, yeah, it, it was very um, enjoyable. I mean, seriously, every, every single episode was just really good. Funny, hilarious. I mean, mm, never got to a point where this show made me cry, unlike my other shows and stuff. But, yeah, you had me on the floor. Not really, yet, but still, you had me on the floor laughing. I think to the point where I was maybe crying of laughter so much because of so many different things. I, I just, I think it's freaking hilarious. <laughs> He got a hard on because, of course, yes, you're you're the only guy around a whole bunch of girls, so we already knew it was gonna happen. And poor Nobuchi had to be the one. <laughs> the fact 
wanted to, she was like, in her sleep, she's like, I am going to figure out what was going on down there. <laughs> oh my god, my poor baby. So honestly, like, yeah, if they wanted to do a season three, um, season three, Jesus Christ, like, we're not there, Deja. Season two of the show, I mean, yes, I would guess they would have to, of course, wait until the manga gets to, like, a certain portion and then animate it from there. Or if they wanted to do like an anime only original type episode OVA, that would be interesting. I mean, because it is such an interesting show. I mean, I would like it to be like some other anime series that I have seen in the past where like they do eventually get an OVA before the possibility of a season two. Um, but really, you know, it's in their hands. The cards are in their fucking hands. Who knows what the fuck they're going to be doing. Um, and how it goes because as we've as I've talked about before, of course, the differences of between getting season twos in Japan versus season twos in America is like completely different and such because of course here in America it's just about like ratings wise and then there I know it's completely different. It's usually like merch sales and a couple other a whole bunch of other things and such that one day I will do more research on whenever I have the time. But right now I'm just like I kind of have time, but at the same time, I don't. But yeah, I really will miss this show. I might have to rewatch it again because it was just so freaking hilarious. And I'll have to use the Crunchyroll version, but that's okay. I don't really care. <laughs> but other than that, guys, that is my reaction for towards the entirety of Onimai. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially all well. Um, this weekend for the mystery shows, of course, so more of Sunday, and then the following week after next week for the start of spring anime, so, yeah, well, not really, because I'll be on vacation, so the week after that, that is when you'll see my reactions to the first official week of spring, and then also the second week, but until then, I will see you guys all next time, bye!